my name is Ethan Alloway. Um, I work for my company, Matterform Inc. Uh, and I do freelance, so I do solutions and uh, video engineering for companies that uh, need weird solutions. So Zero Density became on my radar um, through Sequin AR, a friend of mine, um, and uh, basically started noticing that a lot of the limitations of um, the user experience for creating automation, creating um, different sort of paths for things was a little hard to do in Unreal. Um, so I'm looking at it more as a long-term goal for using and integrating with other systems. So it's nice for me to start learning this because then I can see different paths on how I would normally have to do things maybe in a blueprint. I can do things more in R graphs, um, use it more as a tool on the top level instead of having to go inside of every project and maybe add something inside. Um, so I really prefer that method. I think it's safer. Um, so I started learning at the original training. Um, I don't, I think that was my first experience with the software, so it was nice to get to see it in action. Um, and I had just come off of doing another production with different software, so it was nice to see uh, the things that I wish I had had access to and didn't have access to, and was like, that's, that's better. <laughs> I, want, I want to mess with that. So uh, it was nice to get to, to learn those different solutions um, to things that I would have done myself earlier. Um, so yeah, I really enjoy uh, you know, seeing the systems laid out in examples um, that were really practical for me to experience. So uh, there was that, and then I, I definitely spent some time uh, creating, let's say, OSC clients or different things inside of Zero Density uh, to just test functionality in between the two trainings. Um, and then this training was nice, having the original experience now going, that's where that goes, that's where that goes, and kind of affirming uh, the knowledge that I learned at the previous one. So it's nice having both levels. <laughs> so the thing I think I like the most about Zero Density is how you are working on a different layer of control instead of being inside of Unreal, you're on the side of Unreal, which is you're beside it essentially. Uh, you can still do all the original things, you can also do all the new things. And I think it's better because uh, I've been on productions where people are inside only and they're just clicking and frantically trying to solve problems. And I think that it's better to be uh, able to be controlled externally. Um, and I think it's just smart because then if something breaks as hardware, you're not depending on that version, you just load the version you need as a file. Um, it's more uh, intuitive, easier in my opinion, um, and also easier to show a client uh, what you're doing instead of clicking inside of Unreal and trying to be like, this does this and this does. So I think it's easier for, for user experience as well.